Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your goodness. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you that your thoughts are good towards us. Thoughts of a good hope in the future. Thank you for your blessing on our lives. Thank you for your blessing on our children. And our children's children, our grandchildren. Oh, Thank you, Lord. Thank you that when we wake up, you're right with us, Lord. Thank you when we go to bed, you're right there with us, Lord. Thank you as we go through our day, you're so close. And ko hodimo skozi dan, si nam zelo blizu. All we have to do is just open our eyes to find Moramo you, Lord. Just cry out, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, you're right there. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You're, our, you're my hiding place. You're my rock. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Strong tower of safety. Mochni. Močna utrdba varnosti. I run to you and I am safe. In samo drešno. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for your presence. Hvala za tvoja prisotnost. That surrounds us. Ki nas obkroža. Thank you, Lord, that you protect us. Hvala ti, Gospod, da nas čitiš. And you deliver us. Od zlobnega. Hallelujah. I nas osvobajaš. For your name's sake. Zaradi svojega imena. Thank you, Jesus. Hvala ti, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Doesn't your heart rejoice? When you think about the goodness of the Lord. And when you think about the things he's done for you. Hallelujah. And the things he's going to do for you. Hallelujah. Then your heart rejoices. Hallelujah. Um, I, I'm so thankful that we can know him. Zelo sem hvaležna, da ga lahko poznamo. I'm so thankful that even as a young person you can know him. In zelo sem hvaležna, da že kot mlada oseba ga lahko poznaš. God can direct your life. Bog lahko usmerja tvoje življenje. God can give you his thoughts and plans for the future. Lahko da svoje načrte in plane za prihodnost. Rada bi malo govorila mladim ljudem. Maybe you don't know exactly where you're going or what you're going to do. Mogoče še ne veš, kam greš in kaj moraš narediti. God has a plan for your life. Ampak Bog ima načrt za tvoje življenje. And he already mapped it out before you were born. In on ga je že splaniral, predan si se rodil. And as we come close to him, in ko prihajamo bliže k njemu, he shows us. Nam on pokaže svoj načrt. Halleluja. Halleluja. He's with you. On je s teboj. He's with you as you go to school. Ko greš v šolo je s tabo. He's with you as you're choosing an occupation. On je s tabo, ko izbiraš svoj poklic. Halleluja. Ask him. Vprašaj ga. Lord, what did you create me for? Gospod, zakaj si mene ustvaril? What did you create? Kaj si ti dal vame? Hallelujah. On ima misli, darove in načrte. In za vse, ki mogoče mislite, da niste mladi, Maybe you feel like I'm stuck in my job. I already chose my career. Well, the Lord can come into any situation and make himself known where you're at. Um, some people may think I chose the wrong occupation. Mogoče kdo razmišlja, jaz nisem izbral pravega poklica. I wish I had gone to school a few more years. Škoda, da nisem še dlje hodil v šolo. And pursued what I really love. In zasledoval to, kar mi je res všeč. Well, I want to tell you, any occupation. Naj ti pojem, vsak poklic. If Jesus is in the center. Če je Jezus v centru. You will prosper. Boš napredoval. You will prosper. Boš napredoval. Joseph. 
Jožef. He went from being the favorite son. On je šel od najbolj ljubljenega sina. And there was so much jealousy because everything he did was good. Kjer je bilo toliko ljubosumja za to, ker karkoli je storil, je bilo dobro. And his father probably said, you're my sunshine boy. In njegov oče ga je klico, moj dragi sin. And all of this bragging made the other brothers jealous. Vse to hvaljenje je povzročilo ljubosumje v njegovih bratih. So he got sold into slavery. Tako da je bil prodan v sužanstvu. And he prospered. In je napredoval. God blessed him. Bog ga je blagoslovil. In the middle of the situation. Sredi situacije. The Lord elevated him. Ga je Bog povzdignil. And the uh, he ended up being um persecuted for unrighteously. In ubistvo je bil preganjan nepravično. For doing the right thing. Delo je pravo stvar. Yeah. He must have been a good-looking young man. Lahko da je dobro izgledal ta mladenič. And this rich, powerful man, Potiphar. In ta bogataš, upljunaš Potifar. Had a wife that began to lust after Joseph. Je imel ženo, ki je bil jo Jože fušeč. And she began to call him, "Come, come to me." Inga je začela vabiti k sebi. And he ran away. In on je pobegnil od nje. And he ran so fast that she was hanging onto his coat. In tako hitro je pobegnil, da je ujela samo del njegovega plašča. And then her husband came home. In potem je moš prišel domov. And she said, "Joseph tried to rape me." In je rekla, "Jožef me je želel posiliti." So what happens? In kaj se je zgodilo? He's thrown in prison. Vržen je bil v zapor. And he prospers. In je prosperiral v zapor. He has so much wisdom. Imel je toliko modrosti. Everyone comes to him. Da so vsi hodili k njemu. And God gives him dreams. In Bog mu je dajal sanje. He gives him an amazing dream. Dal mu je osupljive sanje. Two men that were serving the king were were brought to the prison. Dva Možakarja, ki sta služila kralju. One was the chef. Malc, ki mi se glede hosem. Ok, two men that served the king were put in prison. Dva služavnika kraljeva sta prišla v zapor. One was the chef. En je bil kuhar. And the other was a wine taster. Drugi pa preizkuševalec vina. And the king had in his mind that someone is trying to kill me. In kralj je razmišljal, nekdo me želi ubiti. In eno dvaju je proti meni. In oba je vrgal v zapor. In Josef dobi te sanje. Jaz ne vem, je on prosil za sanje. I don't know when he went to sleep if he was worshiping the one Jehovah. Ali mogoče slavil Jahveja, ko je predan je zaspal. Be glorified in my life here in the prison. Bodi proslavljen v moj življenju. But he's falling asleep. Ampak zaspal je. He gets this dream. In dobi sanje. And he sees that one will be promoted. In vidi da bo eden od teh dveh promoviran. And will be back serving the king. In bo spet služil kralju. And then he sees the other will be Put up on a gallows. Drugi bo pa šel na vislice. And he has to tell them this dream. In mora jim povedati svoje sanje. And it comes true just as he said. In točem tako se je zgodilo, kot jim je povedal. God rewards faithfulness. God honors faithfulness. Bog nagradi zvestovo. He didn't know what would happen with the rest of his life. On ni vedel, kaj se bo zgodilo s preostalim delom njegovega življenja. All he knew is, I need to be faithful to God where I am. Ampak vedel je, moram ostati zvezd Bogu. Ne glede na to, kje sem. I'm not going to get bitter. Ne bom se zagrenil. I'm not going to allow the devil to lie to me. Ne bom dovolil hudiču, da mi laže. I will wake up and rejoice in my God. Zbudil se bom in radoval v gospodu. I will believe that he is good and kind. Verjel bom, da je Bog dober in prijazen. And no matter how bad the situation is, ne glede na to, kako težka je moja situacija, he can turn it around for his glory. Bog jo lahko obrne za svoje dobro. So the king has a bad dream. Torej, kralj je sedaj dobil slabe sanje. And he says, All of you wise magicians. In je rekel, vsi vi modri modrci. Come and tell me my dream. Povejte mi moje sanje. And the meaning. 
in pomen letech. And he's very serious. In bil je zelo resen. He says, if you don't do this, you're all going to die. In rekel, če vam ne uspe, boste vsi ubiti. Okay, president. Okay, predsednik. We can't make this up. Ne moramo si zdaj tega zmisliti. Because you know the dream and we don't. Ker ti veš, kaj si sanjal, mi ne vemo, kaj si sanjal. And so the king is so angry. In kralj je bil tako jezen. And he's ready to get rid of all of his advisors. In se je bil pripravljen znebiti vseh svojih svetovalcev. And someone remembers Joseph. In nekdo se spomni Jožepa. I remember there was a man who had a dream. Spomni se, bil je človek, ki je imel sanje. And it was from God. Ki so bile od Boga. So they go to the prison and they say, In grejo v zapor. Joseph, will you come interpret the dream? In reči Jožefa, pridaš prevesti te sanje. And he tells the king the dream. In on pove kralju, kaj je sanjo? You probably remember it. Najbrž se spomnite tega. There were some cows. O krava. And they got, they were eating and then they got thinner and thinner and looked like they were going to die of starvation. Ki so toliko shuljšale že, da so zgledale, da bo odlako to umrli. And I didn't plan to preach this, so I haven't looked it up, but I think it was wheat. There was something else. Was it wheat? Just preach. Okay. So he saw something else that was prospering. In še nekaj je videl, kar je uspevalo. And God told him the interpretation for the dream. In Bog mu je dal prevod teh sanj. That you're going to have seven years of prosperity. Da bo imel sedem let prosperitete. And seven years of famine. In sedem let lakote. And it will be such a bad famine that everything is going to be eaten and taken. In bo tačno lakote, da bo vse umrlo. And the king says, what shall I do? In kralj je rekel, kaj naj storim? Who can I get to help me? Who is wise? Kdo mi lahko pomaga? Kdo je moder? And he turns to Joseph. In se obrne k Jožefu. And he says, I trust you. In mu je rekel, da mu zaupa. He saw God in Joseph. On je videl Boga v Jožefu. He saw the hand of God, the fear of God in Joseph. Videl je Božjo roko, Božji strah v Jožefu. He knew that no one had told him this dream. Vedel je, da nihče ni mogel vedeti njegovi sanj. Only the God of heaven could do it. Samo Bog v nebesih je lahko razodel. So he said, what do we do? In zato ga je vprašal, kaj naj storimo? He said, collect during the seven years of prosperity. In mu je rekel, zbiraj sedem let. Zdaj, ko je prosperiteta, zbirajte sedem let. Collect everything extra and we'll save it for that. In bomo hranili vse, kar je viška, da bomo imeli za potem. Well, I won't go into the whole story. Ne bom šla zdaj v celo zgodbo. Because the main thing I want you to think about tonight ker želim, da nocoj razmišljate o tem, is wherever you're at in life. Da kjer koli ste v svojo življenju. Whether you're serving a king. Ali služiš kralju. And you feel like your life is really making a difference. In, in se počutiš, ja, moje življenje res je zelo pomembno. Or whether you're just doing something day after day. Ali pa samo delaš neko vsak dane v rutino. In a job that just doesn't seem to make sense to you. V službi, ki nima smisla, kot se tebi to zdi. As you invite God into your situation. Ko povabiš Boga v svojo situacijo. The presence of God. Je Božja prisotnost. Can grow in your life. Tak ki lahko raste v tvojo življenju. And the Lord. In gospod will bring promotion. Bo ti bo dal promocijo. His promotion. In to svojo promocijo. Hallelujah. His way. Na svoj način. Hallelujah. And maybe you're retired. Lahko si v penzi. What a wonderful opportunity. To je čudovita priložnost. What a wonderful opportunity to say, Lord, use my days. Kakšna čudovita priložnost, da rečeš, Bog, uporabi moje dneve. Use my days on earth. Uporabi moje dneve na zemlji. To bring glory to your name. Da prinesem slavo tvojemu imenu. To help others to know you. To pomagam drugim, da te spoznajem. To be generous. Da sem radodaren. To be kind. Da sem prijazen. To give godly counsel. Da lahko dam Božje na svete. To love the unloved. Da ljubim neljubljene. To pray for the sick. Da molim za bolnike. To go out and be Jesus in a lost world. Da lahko predstavljam Jezusa v izgubljenem svetu. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
I've been looking at Psalms 91 all year. To leto sem skozi celo leto šla čez psalm 91. And um, if you know this psalm, it's it's the most popular song of protection. To je najbolj popularen psalm Bože zaščite. And um, it's just amazing song. In res, uh, I want us to look at some things, a few things in it tonight. Demo si pogledat ene par stvari v njem. Um, he who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Psalm uh, 1. Verse 1. Aha. Kdor stanuje v zavetu najvišjega, bo počiva v vsencu vsemogočnega. Oh, hallelujah, I just love this. He who dwells. Tako mi je vše, kdor živi, stanuje. In the secret place of the most high. V zavetju najvišjega. Will abide under the shadow of the almighty. Bo počiva v vsencu vsemogočnega. Hallelujah. Um, God is here and we're right here in his protective okay. shadow. Tukaj in mi smo v njegovi zaščitni senci. He's just saying, come up, live with me. In on nas kliče, pridi gor in živi z mano. Dwell with me. Stanuj pri meni. Talk to me. Govori z menoj. All through the day. Skozi cel dan. You don't have to have a scheduled time. You can come in. Ne potrebuješ sam določen termin, kdaj lahko govoriš Bogu. Anytime you want, come into my presence. Bog te govori, vedno lahko prideš v mojo prisotnost. Oh, I heard a story about, I don't remember which, I think it was Eisenhower, Mislim, one of the presidents. Ne vem, je bil predsednik Eisenhower ali en od teh. And um, so he had a lot of things to do. Ki je imel veliko za narest. And that's around the time of the World War. V času svetovne vojne. But someone came to visit. And he said, whenever this person comes, the door is open. And who was it? His son. His son. And that's why God is with us. He says, the door is always open. Just come in. Just sit with me. Just talk to me. Open up your heart. And express the deepest longings. I love to be with you. Yes, ljubim biti s tebi. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. He who dwells. Ta, ki stanuje in the secret place v skrivališču of the most high, v zavetju najvišega will abide bo počival under the shadow v senci of the almighty vsem obočem hallelujah hallelujah that's where i want to live yes hoćem tam živeti that's where i want to stay yes hoćem ostati yeah. tam hallelujah hallelujah oh i remember when david was little yes se spomnim ko bo david majhan he had a, a bit of a hard time in school. Je imel težke trenutke v šoli. And there was some bullying going on. Kjer so ga malo preganjali. And um, he was happy if his dad would come to school. In on je bil vesel, če njegov oče prišel v školu. <laughs> because my dad is a big guy. <laughs> Moj oče je dost velik. And he was the second smallest uh, kid. On je bil pa drugi najmanjši otrok in his class. <laughs> And now he's like this. But, Zdaj je pa ful yeah. velo. So, um, you know, I know that he, he walked proudly when he was by his dad. On je bil ful ponosen, če je zrano očeta lahko pozdrav. He felt safe. In pol se je čutil varno. And like, um, you can't do anything to me now. Zdaj me noben, inač ne more, ker sem na varno. Hallelujah. And that we would come up to pa, pa, God like that. Oh, we just want to be close to him. We just want to be close. Be yeah. be close. We yeah. just want to put our head Hočemo on da him. We just want you to love njega. us. Hočemo we just want to hear your voice. Hočemo Hallelujah. Tvoj glas. And then you'll live under that shadow of the Almighty. That protection. Senco, oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will say of the Lord. Rekel bom o Gospodu. He is my refuge. Naslednji citat. 
On je moje zatočišče. He is my fortress. On je moj grad. He is my God. On je moj Bog. In him I will trust. Hallelujah. I love this. I'm going to speak about it. Ljubi to. Govorju okay. bom o gospodu. I'm going to speak about you, Lord. Govorila bom o tebi, I'm not just going to keep it inside. Ne bom samo zadržavala v sebi. But I will say. Pa bom govorila. You are my fortress. Ti si moja trnjava. You are my deliverer. Ti si moj rešitelj. Let's say that. Recimo to. Okay. How do you say in Slovenia? Ti si moj... Ti si moj grad. Ti si moj grad. Oh, yes. Ti si moj upanja. I don't know. I don't, I'm not sure how... Moj bevelišća. Ti si moj... 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 I will speak it. I will say it out loud. Oh, hallelujah. I'm not just going to think it. Ne bom samo razmišljala. Sometimes you need to say it. Učasih moš reči. Hallelujah. And when you say, I remember I was in Osijek. Spalnim se, ko sem bila v Osijek. And I was teaching, it was during the Croatian-Serbian war. Med to vojno, med Hrvaškom Srbijo. And you could sometimes hear the explosions across the drama. River at night. And I remember walking in the basement in the prayer room. And I would say over and over, Lord, you are good. Lord, you are good. Lord, you are good. This is your city. This is your nation. Oh, Jesus, be Lord. Be Lord. Be Lord. And just declaring. In to oznanjaš. It was a strange time. In to je bilo, bil čudan čas. There was a, a, a depressive spirit over, duh, over the place. Tam je bil kar močen duh depresije. And um, as, as soon as you started to declare. In takoj, ko začneš oznanja. You reign. Ti vladaš. You rule. Ti kraljuješ. You are king. Ti si kralj. You are God. Ti si Bog. Heaviness went down. Potem ni več težine. Težina zgine. Faith rose up. Vera se dvigne. And you can begin to see the heart of God. In lahko vidiš srce Boga. Don't stay in the valley. Ne ostani v dolini. Sometimes there's going to be places that are valleys. Včasih so doline pred nami. And people around you may be in a dark place. But as you declare, God is good. Lord, you've got this. You're in control. You're bigger than all problems around me. You're king. You're my savior. You're my healer. You're my redeemer. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will say. I will say. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. And surely he will deliver me. In sigurno, on me bo odrešil. When you're reading the verse 3, ko vidimo v tretji vrstici, I like to personalize it. Rada dam to v osebni pomen. And say, Lord, you'll deliver me. Kaj ti gospod bo odrešil mene, on me bo odrešil in vsake kuge pogube. In če pride, grem skoz nekaj in zmagovano grem naprej. Ker ti skrbi za me. Ti me pokrivaš s mojimi perutami. In naslednji citat, pod njegovimi krili se mi je moje zavetje. His truth is my shield and buckler. Ščitim bran je njegova resnica. Hallelujah. Have you seen those pictures going around on Facebook of um, a swan and her babies are all under her feathers? Uh, 
uh, Wales got pa maikni la bodi za njim. They're all on her back, kind of in inside of her feathers. Nekaj spod peruk mi ta Wales ga la boda. I love that picture, because it reminds me of this verse. In ta citat me spominja na to sredi. Hallelujah, he will cover me with his feathers. On me pokriva svojimi perutmi. Under his wings, I will take refuge. In pod krivi njegovi mi je moj zarete. A chicken gathers her little chicks underneath her feathers so that the fox can't come and eat them. And, and God says, just like that, I'm going to gather you. I'm going to protect you. I'm going to surround you completely. Hallelujah. His truth Njegova resnica je tvoj ščit in bran. Kako poznamo njegovo resnico? V njegovi besedi je resnica. Ko začenjamo novo leto, vas hočem ohrabriti, berite Božjo besedo. Ne samo brati. Prosim Svetega Duha, da ti odpira oči, da jo razumeš. Čudovite stvari so v njegovi besedi. In Sveti Duh nam lahko odpira oči. Ne vem, na kakšen način vi radi berete Sveto pismo. Jaz sem nekaj rekel, uporabljala aplikacijo Sveto pismo skozi eno leto z Niki Gamblom. Mogoče to delaš, mogoče imaš svoje Sveto pismo. Ampak prosi gospoda, da ti pokaže, kako lahko preučuješ njegovo besedo. Kako lahko rastem v tebi. Če še nisi bral Svetega pisma, pojdi čez Mateja, Marka, Luka, Janeza, čez Evangelijo. In tam noter gledaš Jezusa. Look at what he taught. Look how he dealt with people. Kako je on delal z ljudmi. And um, look at his parables. In potem gledaš njegove prilike. Hallelujah, and you'll grow. In rastaš. Hallelujah, if you've read the Gospels. Če si prebral Evangelijo. Go to the prison epistles. Beri zaporniška pisma. Efežans, Filipijans, Kološans. First Peter. Prvo Petro. All of these kind of books are very practical. Vse te praktične knjige. Kološans and Efežans. Kološanom in Efežanom. The first half is all about who is Jesus. Prva polovica vedno govori o tem, kdo je Jezus. Who are you in Jesus? Kdo si ti v Jezusu? And the second half. Druga polovica. How do you live? Kako zdaj živimo? How do you live like Jesus? Kako lahko zdaj živimo kot Jezus? How does your life shine for His glory? Kako lahko naše življenje sveti temu svetu? If you haven't read them, če jih še nisi bral, it's amazing. So supliva. Hallelujah. The prayers of Paul. Paolove molitve. Hallelujah. You'll never pray the same way. Nikoli več ne moraš isto mod. Hallelujah. If you're interested in what's happening in the world, če te zanima, kaj se dogaja v svetu, Lahko bereš razvedetje in vidiš, kaj ima Bog za povedanje. Za modrost beri pregovore. V vsako situaciji, v kateri se znajdeš, beri psalme. Vidiš, ko je David gor, vidiš, ko je David dol. In sredu vsega blagoslavlja Gospod. Torej, njegova beseda je resnica. Njegova resnica je ščit. In bran. V Božju bojnju prijemu. Vidimo, da obstaja pas resnice. In ta pas drži skupaj vso prijemu. In to je iz Božje besede. Jezus je resnica. Peta vrstica. Če ho vsebim, Ne bom se bal 
Noć me ga strahu. Ali, if you have nightmares. Če imaš nočne more. Or if you have problems falling asleep at night. Pa da ne moraš zaspat po noči. Maybe your mind is just playing what could happen. Tvoj um non stop razmišlja, kaj bi se lahko zgodilo, kaj se more zgodilo. You shall not be afraid of terrible night. You said I won't be afraid. That you minister to your beloved even in their sleep. You will not be afraid. Of terror by night, nor the arrow that flies by day nor the pestilence that walks in darkness. Ne. 6, verse 6, Sammy. Ne pogube, ki lazi v temi. Nor destruction. Ne kuge, ki rasaja. That lays waste at noon. Opolne. You're not going to be afraid of anything. Ne bo se bal ni česa. Hallelujah. A thousand may fall at your side. Tisoč jih lahko pade v tvoje strane. Ten thousand at your right hand. Na srednji citat. Deset tisoč na drugi strani. It will not come near you. A tebi se ne približa. Hallelujah. I have a friend whose son is the same age as David. Mi mam this kind of is rich one. It's all right. It won't be. It won't be too much longer. Is it okay? 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 Okay, I have a friend Maria who's son is in the Ukrainian army. Kdor bo zadnji ustal v dubina gradu? Aha, moja kolegica Maria ma sina, ki je v ukrajinski vojski. And I give her this first. Oh, Ukraine army? Yeah. So she's Ukrainian friend? Maria. She's from Ukraine? Yes. Nina kolegica iz Ukrajine, Je zdaj njen sin v vojni v Ukrajini. And I gave her this verse. In sem mi dala ta citat. A thousand may fall at your side. Tisoč jih pade na tvoj strani. And ten thousand at your right hand. Vse tisoč na tvoj desnici. But it shall not come near. A tebi se ne približa. Hallelujah. Isn't that a wonderful promise? A ni to čudovito obljuba. Hallelujah. Others may be going through something so horrible. Lahko da gre kdo res čez grozne stvari. But it won't come near you. It won't come near you. Only with your eyes will you look and see the reward of the wicked. Verse 9. Verse 9. Verse 9. Because you have made the Lord who is my refuge. Ker si rekel, ti gospod si približališče moje. Even the most high, your dwelling place. Najviše ga si postavil za prebivališče svoje. No evil shall befall you. Ne zadanete nesreča nobena. Nor shall any plague come near your dwelling. In šiba se ne približa tvojemu šotoru. Because he shall give his angels charge over you. Zakaj angelom svojim zapovezate. To keep you in all of your ways. Da te hranijo po vse po te tvoji. Hallelujah. This is so good. Lord, you said that no evil would befall me. Lord, you said no plague will come near my dwelling. So what do you do if you end up having a fever? And a sore throat. And you say, Lord, you said there will be no plague near my dwelling. Gospod, ti si rekel, nobena kuga ne pride v moje prebivališče. Well, there's a few things that we can do. Par stvari lahko naredimo. Rebuke the enemy. Lahko ukorimo sovražnika. Ask the Lord for healing. Speak healing over our body. Kličemo ozdravljenje v svoje življenje. And we can take a rest. Sometimes when you're taking a rest, the Lord will speak to you. 
um, when I taught in Osia, I got bronchitis. Uh, and I was supposed to lead worship for a in youth conference. Mogla bi vodat slavljenje na mladinski konferenci. And I was really excited. In sem bila resna vdušana. And I couldn't even talk. Ampak še govorit nisem mogla. <laughs> and I was laying in bed. In sem ležala v pojsti. Saying, Lord. Gospod. Why am I sick? Zakaj sem bolana? Don't you need me? <laughs> A me ne rabiš. <laughs> and um, the Lord said, Carol. In Bog mi rekel, Carol. You haven't honored my Sabbath. Nisi častila moje sobote. You never honor my Sabbath. Nikol ne častiš. And take a rest. Nikol ne počivaš. And um, I was so busy. In sem bila tok zaposlena. Busy teaching. Uh, z učenjem. And then on the weekend. In potem um, za vikend. Work in the church. Delam v cerkvi. Busy, busy, busy. Skos, busy, busy, busy. And I didn't realize that um our <laughs> <laughs> um, I didn't realize that our physical bodies need rest. God created the world in six days. On the seventh day he rested. In sedmi dan je počival. Was he tired? Ali je bil trujen? I don't think so. Po moje, da ne. I think he rested to show us. Ampak je počival, da nam pokaže. This is the way to do life. Tako živite. Um, so, I, I don't want to put condemnation on anybody. Nočem obsojat kogar od vas. But I do want to say that. Ampak želim vam povedat. God wants us to take time that we say, Lord, refresh me. Da Bog hoče, da imaš čas, ko lahko rečeš, Bog osveži me. For many years, I took Monday. Jaz sem veliko let v pondelkih imela ta dan. And I tried to limit what I had to do. In takrat omejem vse, kar moram delat. And just get some rest. Da lahko počivam. Um, some of you, can, of course, can't do that. You're working on Monday. Any od vas pač ne morate, ko nimate takih možov doma, da vse delajo za vas. Maybe you can take Saturday. Ampak mogoče lahko pa soboto, recimo. Maybe you can take Sunday. Mogoče nedelje. Maybe you can take half a day here and half a day here. Lahko pa odneva tu, pa tam. I don't know, but it's a spiritual principle. Ampak to je duhovni princip. Um, God rested from his labors and he said, it's good. Je počival od svojega dela in potem je rekel, dobro je. And sometimes God wants us to stop. In včasih Bog želi, da se ostaviš. And look at what's happening. In da vidiš, kaj so vse dogaja. And just say, it's good. In rečeš, dobro je. Oh, hallelujah. Look what you're doing, Lord. It's good. Gospod, dobre stvari delaš. Hallelujah. Rest in him. In potem počivaš v njem. And then he gives us strength for the next part. In potem nam da moč za drugi del. Oh, hallelujah. It's like a marathon. Hallelujah. To je kot maraton. Don't just do a sprint. Ne samo laufat štri. And then fall down and... In potem padaš dol. Yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. Let's go on. Ja, neč, gremo naprej lahko. He will give his angels charge over you. Zdaj mi je čel za počitek. On bo dal svoj mangelom za povezate do tehano po vseh tvojih poteh. A veš, da te angeli čuvajo? How many of you have seen an angel take care of you before? A je kdo od vas že videl angela, da je poskrbel za tebe? Maybe you didn't see, but you saw the result. Da vam, da ga nisi videl, pa veš, da je angel je nekaj poskrbel za tebe. Oh my goodness, yes. Oh my, yes, Lord, protecting you. <laughs> Stopping accidents. And who knows how many times angels intervened and we didn't know. In kdo ve, koliko krat so angeli posredovali, ne da bi se mi zavedali. The Bible says angels are here to help. Sveto pismo pravi, angeli so tu, da nam pomagajo. They are messengers, they help prinašajo Bože sporočilo, ki nam pomaga. Oni poskrbijo za 
I don't talk to my angel. Jaz se ne pogovarjam s mojimi angeli. Aloisa. Aloisa from um, Uganda. Aloisius iz Uganda. Um, said, Carol, I was praying for you, Carol. Je rekel, Carol, molil sem za te. And I saw one angel standing beside you. In sa angela, ki je stal pod zran tebe. And I, I saw him giving you and singing songs from heaven into your ear. In sem videl, da ti poje pesmi v uho. Oh, what a beautiful picture. Kakšna čudovita slika. I remember in the old building we used to be at, there was one side I'd always feel like a tall angel was standing there. And um, one time Abner in Abner je nekega dneva and was actually here in Shentur and he saw two very tall angels taller than the ceiling Večjo od stropa. Standing here in worship. Ki sta stala z nami med slavljenjem. Oh, hallelujah. If our eyes could only see. Če bi lahko le videli z očmi. What's happening in the supernatural? Kaj se v nadnaravnem dogaja? Do you remember the story when Elisha, the king was surrounded by five armies? Se spomnite, ko je Elizaj videl vojske angelov, ki so obkrožile sovražnika. And the king was terrified. Kralja je bilo strah. And Elisha said, Lord, open his eyes to see. Elizaj je rekel, odpri njegove oči, da bo lahko videl, da jih je več z nami, kot proti nam. And he saw a massive angel army. In videl je masivne vojske angelov. And the army that was against him became blind. In vojska ki je bila proti njim, je oslepela. In je Bog poskrbel za njim. Če bi lahko le videli vse, kar Bog dela, in kako skrbi za te, in kako skrbi za tvojo troke, potem bi imel velik miru in radosti v srcu. Ok, kako mora vse. Samo še dvanaj citatov. They'll hold you up in their hands, bear you up, so you'll not dash your foot against the stone. Na rokah te bodo nosili, da ne zadeno iz nogo svoje obkame. You'll tread on the lion and cobra. Odivljem levo bo škodil in kači. The young lion and serpent you will trample under feet. Te ptal boš levo mladiča in zmaja. I, I'm a, I would be afraid of a lion. <laughs> I think I'd be afraid of a lion. Would you be afraid of a lion? Oh. But it says you will tread on the lion and the cobra. The devil disguises himself like a roaring lion. But he has no teeth. Ampak nima zelo. So moč je zgubil na križu. In Jezus je lev judovega plemena. In kdo je kača? Hudič. Hudič. In hodil boš po moči hudiča. Res ljubim ta naslednji del. Because he has said his love on me, I will deliver him. This is God speaking back. In zdaj Bog nam govori, ker mi je vdan v ljubezni, pravi Bog, ga hočem obteti. Because he said his love on me. Se pravi, ker mi je vdan v ljubezni. God looks right into your heart. Bog gleda v tvoj srce. And he says, Lesh, because you set your love on me. A Lesh, ker se mi vdan v ljubezni, te bom odrešil. I'm going to deliver you. I'll deliver you. I'll deliver you. Andre, he looks right at you and he says, because you set your heart to love me. Andre, Bog gleda na te in prav, ker si si usmeril svoje srce, da me ljubiš. I will deliver you. Te bom jaz odrežil. Alleluja. Oh, thank you, Lord. Alleluja. Just raise your hand. Alleluja, lahko vignemo rok. And just say, thank you. Samo reč, hvala ti. Thank you, Lord. Hvala ti, gospod. Thank you that you promise you'll never leave me. Hvala, da si ti obljubil, da me boš rešil. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah.
Thank you, Lord, that you see that we love you. Thank you that you respond with deliverance and freedom. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. And this is the promise to you. God said, he shall call me, I will answer him. I'll be with him in trouble. I'll deliver him. I'll honor him. And with long life I will satisfy him. I'll show him my salvation. You said you do that for us just Hvala, because we love you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord, we pray that we would walk in awareness of what you're doing, Holy Spirit. That we would walk in confidence of hearing the shepherd's voice. And that we'd walk without fear. And that we'd know that you deliver us from any plans of the enemy. Hallelujah. And the path of the righteous is brighter and brighter. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. With long life, I will satisfy him. Hallelujah. And show him my salvation. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your promises. They're so good. They're so good. They're so good. They're so good. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. As we enter the new year, Hallelujah. Remind yourself of this. Say, oh, God is for me in 2023. Hallelujah. The Lord sent his angels to watch over me in this year. The Lord will go before me and protect my steps. The Lord will deliver me. Hallelujah. From everything that would come against me. Hallelujah. And because I set my love on him, he will deliver me and show me salvation. Hallelujah. Lord, let your light shine bright in my life. Let your strength take us from glory to glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. I pray that you would give us dreams for this new year. That you'll release hope. That you'll release joy. Peace. Our lives would be full of your love. So Hallelujah. And that people would be drawn to you, Lord. That this nation would be full of your love. Hallelujah. Thank Pola you, Lord. Your kingdom come. Your will be done. Here on earth. In Slovenia. Just like heaven. Tako kot te v nebesu. Tako kot te v nebesu. Tvoja popolna voda. Molim nad družinami. Mir v odnose. Radost. Razumevanje. Modrost v staršu. Sveti duh. Couples will have a new love and appreciation. Hallelujah, God. Lord, show us who's hungry for you. Show us who's ready. And help us to make the door open wide. Da odpiramo vrata za da lahko vstopijo v Tvoje kraljestvo. Hvala Ti, Gospod. Molim za moč Tvojega duha da pride nad nas Tvoje ljudstvo da lahko vodimo v nadnaravno mazine. Hvala Ti, Gospod. Pray for revival in the youth, in the young generation. Pray for a move of God in this nation that would be so much bigger than anything that's ever happened.
Kdor, kol še rabaš molitev, bomo tukaj leče v slovljenju. 